um, the technology that we're using today, I would say, it, it doesn't really have an obsolete time bomb ticking on it right now. In looking at the way uh, technology is used in the classroom, I think that the technology that we're currently using, we would think about something like a five or six year replacement cycle in general. It's not that different from Kindle. And so the technology that's being put in the auditorium mirrors what you're experiencing in the classrooms in the Kimball Hall um, building, as well as Old Main, Peabody, Epley Center. And the beauty of that is the consistency of technology and the consistency of experience, especially for our faculty and our instructors. You don't have to learn three and four different systems. And there's a comfort level, and you get an adoption of technology by um, creating an uh, environment that people are comfortable using. There's actually a lot of instructors are technology dependent to the point where they'd almost rather cancel a class than not have their technology they're used to using. So it's even more mission critical than it used to be that if we're going to put this in, it has to be stable. So we'll sometimes err on the side of lower tech, technically, aka less complex, in order to provide something that's a lot more stable. Uh, the number of you know, support calls we have to do, extremely minimal compared to the number that we used to. And so I go into those meetings with my motto, just because you can doesn't mean you should. Because what you have to have is something that you can sustain economically. You can't buy a $10,000 computer and replace it every five years. When you multiply that, just think of 40 in Kimball, even if you were doing you know, a fourth of them every 10 years. So finding an, an environment that's flexible enough to cover the diverse needs of the campus, it has to be economical. And, you know, the replacement cycle um, has to be affordable. And so it was a pretty cool process. It isn't, it isn't just IT picking some technology and throwing it out there. It's very democratic.